today i'm gonna be trading justin jefferson to the baltimore ravens to see if they can win a super bowl i mean obviously before the playoffs the ravens were by far the best team in the nfl this season i think they were definitely better than san francisco so hopefully justin jefferson can bring this team to a super bowl so that i can stop thinking about how we choked in the afc championship game i mean as you can see obviously justin jefferson takes this offense to the next level and i mean on the other hand you guys already knew this but the ravens probably have the best defense in the league right now i mean i'm thinking that lamar jackson and justin jefferson should be a very solid duo but as you can see in week one we're gonna be taking on the houston texans i mean at this point i'd say lamar jackson kind of owns cj stroud so hopefully we can just keep doing what we've been doing edwards is gonna get a first down on the first play of the game i'm gonna go for another run after that and i mean as long as this works out for us i'm probably gonna try and go for a shot with jefferson and hopefully oh yeah edwards is gone again this guy is actually on a tear right now that's another first down i mean he got smoked like three or four times there but somehow he stayed up through all of the contact edwards already has 32 yards on the run which is pretty ridiculous it looks like jefferson is gonna be open for oh we're just short i thought we had the first down there but i mean to be fair the way edwards is playing i don't think one yard is gonna be that much of an issue for us it looks like we are gonna get that texans did bring up a third down after that though i mean i was gonna try and score a touchdown with jefferson but i'm just gonna go for zay flowers because i feel like this is probably a safer bet for us that's gonna be another first so i mean after all of that six yards to go and we're in i am hoping that jefferson can finish this drive off if not i might just go on the run actually come on he's gonna be open there that's gonna be justin jefferson's first touchdown as a raven on the first drive of the season which is also gonna give us the lead over to texans so hopefully our defense can play well today so we can sneak out with a dub i mean we did end up winning in overtime but somehow we went that whole game only scoring two touchdowns and the second touchdown was in overtime so i don't know what happened there for some reason that game was all defense i thought we were gonna tear through houston but apparently not either way we got the dub so, I mean, obviously, we're off to a 1-0 start after that. With a team like this, I mean, we'd almost have to try to miss the playoffs if we were to miss the playoffs. And it looks like we're going to finish off the season going 15-2 to absolutely annihilate the division and get the number one seed, which is definitely nice to see. Jefferson did have a pretty mediocre season, though. I mean, he only had 765 yards for five touchdowns. And it looks like we're going to be taking on the Colts in the divisional round. And it looks like we're going to sneak away with the win. So, now we have to play play Patrick Mahomes and the Chiefs for a trip to the Super Bowl. We did stop the Chiefs on the first drive of the game, so hopefully we can get off to a hot start here. I'm just praying that this can be Lamar Jackson's revenge game. We're gonna find Jefferson for the first down. I mean, as I said, I had a feeling that this was gonna be a crazy duo, and it seems like Lamar Jackson and Justin Jefferson are definitely looking like a crazy duo, even though he surprisingly enough did not do the greatest in the regular season. But I mean, 700 yards is still pretty solid, obviously. I'm gonna try and go for flowers here. That is dangerous, but we're gonna bring it in. So, I mean, just like that, we are kind of set up. 30 yards to go, and we're in. I'm gonna keep it on the ground this time, and hopefully, it looks like Lamar's gonna have some open field. That might work out for a touchdown. Come on. We're gonna get caught at the 14, but either way, I mean, obviously, that's a pretty solid 16 yard pickup. I'm gonna try and go for Mark Andrews on this play, unless Jefferson can somehow get wide open, which he is not. Everyone's kind of locked up, so I gotta keep this on the ground we are gonna get the first down kind of sucks that we couldn't get the touchdown there but i mean at least we got the first down i'm just gonna keep it on the ground this time though and hopefully edwards can punch this in if not we're gonna have to work off of a third down but it looks like we are one yard short i mean it's all good i feel like one yard won't be that much of a problem i'm just gonna try and qb sneak this and hopefully chris jones doesn't stuff us like that this kind of backfired on me i really wasn't expecting things to go this way but i'm going for it on fourth down since we only need a yard come on we're gonna be stopped at the line i mean clearly that was a wasted opportunity but on the bright side we're coming back out here in the fourth quarter we are up 26 to 24 right now since the chiefs had the ball at their own one yard line since we couldn't convert 
we were able to force them into a safety. So, I mean, that's why we're up by two points right now. So, I mean, it sort of worked out for us, but a touchdown definitely would have been a whole lot better. But I mean, as long as we actually score a touchdown this time, the Chiefs are going to need an absolute miracle if they want to come back in this game. So, hopefully, oh yeah, Flowers is open. That's not going to be a first though. I probably shouldn't be doing this, but I'm going to put in the air right now just because the Chiefs totally shut down the run game last time. And it looks like we're actually going to have Andrews wide open. So that is going to pay off for us. That's another first. I'm just trying my best here to make sure we keep this drive alive. I'm going to try and go for a shot with Jefferson, though. He might. Oh, it looks like he's going to be wide open. Come on, get that. Mm, we're going to get caught. But we are literally two yards short once again. I mean, this time I'm going to keep it in the air. Because obviously when we ran it last time, Chris Jones shut it down every single... Oh, we're getting sacked. Bro, what is going on right now? I don't want to like go out and blame everything on the O-line, but they are kind of folding today. So now we need 12 yards for the touchdown. I swear if we came all this way just to get snubbed again, I'm going to be extremely butthurt. But it looks like we're going to find Zay in the corner for the touchdown. I have no idea how he got those feet down because it looked like he was out of bounds, but I'll take it. That's going to put us up by two scores with two minutes on the clock. And thankfully for us, after that, it looks like our defense was able to close the game out. So that's going to send the Ravens to the Super Bowl in the first season. But to end off year number one, it looks like MVP ended up going to Patrick Mahomes this season. I mean, Lamar came second place in the voting, and we're also going to be taking on the Cowboys in the Super Bowl, who are 16-1. and one. I mean, all honesty, considering this team has only lost one game all season this might be even tougher than it was to beat kansas city i mean lamar's gone on the first play of the game okay somehow we're still going i mean one play in and this guy's already got the ball all the way to the 43 i'm gonna try and go for zay flowers on this play though it looks like he's actually gonna be wide open that's gonna be really close but it looks like we're gonna squeeze in for the touchdown so i mean i definitely call that a hot start two plays into the game and we've already scored so we're up seven nothing right now i am really hoping that we can keep the same energy all game we're coming back out here in the fourth quarter though i mean things are looking pretty good for us right now we're up by seven points so if we can score here obviously i wouldn't say that would put the game away just yet because dallas will still have a whole lot of time to work with but i mean that would definitely help our chances going up by two scores right now and once again it looks like we have a path with lamar that's another crazy pickup i mean it seems like he is going off today as well because he's got 85 yards on the ground so it doesn't seem like the Cowboys have really had an answer for Lamar today. I'm going to keep it on the ground once again here. That's all. Oh, that's another first. I'm really tempted to just keep rushing it with Lamar because he is destroying this defense right now. But I'm going to put in the air this time because I feel like if we keep it on the ground the whole game, I mean, we're going to get shut down at some point. So I'm just going to keep switching it up. I mean, honestly, with 14 yards to go, as long as Parsons isn't an issue here, I'm hoping Lamar can just sneak this in because, I mean, as I've said, Oh, we're going to get flagged, man. That's going to be coming back, too. That wasn't going to be a touchdown, but we would have been set up, man. I mean, of course, Simpson had to hold there. And now we're getting sacked by Micah Parsons. They got another stop after that, too. So, I mean, now it's third and 27. So, if this doesn't work out, I'm just going to kick a field goal. Because either way, we would be up by two scores. Everyone's locked up. That might put us out of field goal range. I mean, this is going to be a long one. That defense definitely clutched up there. We need 59 yards but with Justin Tucker as our kicker, I feel like we should be able to make that. I mean, that is perfect. We're going to go up by two scores. And it looks like that field goal ended up being very, very important because the Cowboys scored again. So we only won that game by a field goal. But either way, we got the job done and that's really all that matters. So one season in with Justin Jefferson and this team has already won a Super Bowl. I mean, honestly, that guy might just be the missing piece that the Baltimore Ravens need. So as you can see to end off year number one, Lamar Jackson and the Baltimore more Ravens are going to be hoisting a well-deserved Lombardi trophy. I mean, coming into year number two, we have the exact same team as last year. So I'm hoping that we'll have another chance to run it back. And
and it looks like we had another very solid season going 14 and 3 to win the division and we're going to be playing the Colts in the wild card round once again Jefferson just isn't doing what he was doing on the Vikings with Baltimore I mean this season he had another decent year with 779 yards for 11 touchdowns but it looks like we're going to get the win against the Colts so now we play the Bills in the divisional round and it looks like we're going to be starting with the ball here as well so I'm going to see if they have a problem against Lamar because I mean so far every team we faced uh Von Miller almost smoked us but somehow Lamar stayed up through the contact and it looks like we're going to bring this one to the house I'm not sure how we had this much open field but that's going to be a one play touchdown run from Lamar Jackson I mean that is probably the hottest start you could possibly ask for so the Ravens are going to get to an early 7-0 lead we're coming back out here in the third quarter though as you can see we're all tied up at 14 now so it seems like Josh Allen is playing pretty well today so I mean if things keep going this way this game is probably going to come right down to the wire I honestly want to just keep running the ball I mean it seems like this defense is nowhere near as good as they used to be Von Miller lost his x factor as well so I mean I wouldn't say the Bills defense is average but they are not as good as they were a year ago they also don't have Micah Hyde or Jordan Poyer anymore which is obviously a big hit for that defense and it seems like they have done a terrible job at stopping us on the run so far Lamar is gone again no way bro <laughs> okay I thought we were gonna bring that back for a second we got it all the way to the 17 though Lamar is making this defense look like a college football team I mean he has 189 yards on the run right now which is obviously ridiculous and Edwards is gonna sneak away for another touchdown I don't think I've thrown the ball once yet I mean we've kept it on the ground pretty much the whole game and it seems to be working out for us so now we're up by seven points once again and luckily for us as you can see after that it looks like the defense was able to close things out I mean the Bills did keep things pretty close, but either way, that's another dub to bring us to another AFC Championship game. And as you can see in this year's AFC Championship game, it looks like we have a rematch against Patrick Mahomes and the Chiefs, who are 15-2. I mean, the Chiefs did score first, so we're down 3-0, but we did have a pretty crazy kick return, so we have the ball at the 46 to start this drive off, and this time Lamar is getting shut down. I mean, so far, he's been running all over every offense he's played, or defense defense he's played with the run game but right now it looks like the Chiefs kind of have him shut down and since we couldn't do anything there that's going to bring up a third and 14 so we are in danger of giving the ball up pretty early here so hopefully flowers can be open of course he's locked up and Chris Jones is going to smoke us coming back out here in the third quarter though the Chiefs are up by three points right now so hopefully we can get something done on this drive because we have been struggling a lot more today I just got to go for safe plays here because I mean it seems like most things that we've ran so far Chris Jones has been one step ahead of us today I mean he shut down pretty much everything that's dangerous but likely he's gonna bring it in I want to try and go for a run of Lamar though I mean this is something that really hasn't worked too well this game but this time it looks like it's gonna be a different story that's gonna be another rushing touchdown Lamar is stealing the show today man I mean I know this is a video about Jefferson being on the Ravens but this guy is pretty much doing everything in his power on the ground to win games. But after that, apparently, it looks like Mahomes ended up clutching things up in the second half. So that is going to send us home. I mean, either way, once again, that was a pretty solid season. I mean, back-to-back -back years in the AFC Championship game is obviously pretty good. But to end off year number two, looks like Josh Allen's going to be winning MVP. And it looks like the Chiefs ended up taking down the Eagles in a Super Bowl rematch. But that's going to bring us to year number three once again this team has not changed whatsoever so i mean i'd say we should be able to keep making the playoffs we kind of fell off this season but either way we had a solid year going 12 and 5 the Bengals won the division though so we play the bills in buffalo in the wild card round i mean lamar was out for four games this year which is kind of why we lost as many games as we did but as you can see jefferson had 830 yards for six touchdowns this season anyways i mean sneaking out of buffalo with a win is something that that is never easy to do especially in the playoffs on the bright side for us though I mean it seems like this defense has gotten even worse than it was last year I mean obviously Buffalo is always a hard team to face either way but they don't have any x factors on the defense anymore so it seems like they keep losing all of their best players that's a pretty solid run from Edwards was not enough for a first down though so I'm gonna try and go for Zay here and hopefully he can pick up the first down I'm pretty sure Flowers has also gone all the way up to like a 92 overall which is 
is definitely a plus for us. I mean, it seems like we're doing pretty good on this drive so far. I'm gonna switch it up this time and go to other direction and hopefully Justin Jefferson can be open here. It looks like nobody's on him. So that's another very big pickup. I mean, it seems like Lamar has definitely been getting shit done. So hopefully he can finish off this drive with a touchdown. I'm just gonna keep it on the ground here. And it looks like we've got a path to the end zone. So that's gonna be another rushing touchdown for Lamar Jackson, which is gonna put the Ravens out in front first. So hopefully we can keep rolling, but Josh Allen is not gonna be an easy guy to play against today. We're coming back out here in the fourth quarter though. We are down 21 to 14 right now. So I mean, things are not looking too good for us right here, but we do have a chance to send it to overtime. So hopefully we can do that. We are working against the clock right now though. So I mean, if we wanna score, we gotta kinda hurry it up here. So I'm gonna try and go for Jefferson on this play who seems to be locked up and Lamar is getting smoke. I mean, we do have all three timeouts, but at the same time, there's only 52 seconds on that clock. So I'm gonna try and go for a shot here. Jefferson's locked up again though. And I don't really have, oh, actually hold on. Lamar might be able to escape here. That is gonna be a huge pickup on a play where we probably should have gotten sacked. So after that, I'm just gonna try and end it off of Zay Flowers. I mean, if Jefferson's open, that would be great, but I feel like he's probably gonna be locked up here zay's open though and it looks like we're gonna be stopped two yards short i mean two yards to go i'm just gonna try and finish this off right here with justin jefferson if La if i have to take lamar on the run i will do that no way we're getting sacked i know i probably should have ran it there but at the same time the bills have been shutting down the run game pretty much all day so far so i'm kind of just trying to keep it in the air we really need this play to work out come on that's gonna be a touchdown from isaiah likely so that should tie things up with 21 seconds to go so it's looking like this game is going to be heading to overtime but i mean apparently justin tucker missed the pat attempt so we lost i actually have no words for what just happened right now i mean that was a game we definitely should have won or at least sent it to overtime because tucker does not usually miss kicks like that but to end off year number three patty mahomes is going to be taking home another mvp once again lamar came second place in the voting and it looks like the chiefs absolutely annihilated violated the commanders in the super bowl but that's gonna bring us to year number four which is gonna be the final season of this video once again this team has not changed whatsoever so i mean this is kind of our last chance to get lamar a second lombardi trophy so hopefully this team can actually clutch it up and it looks like the ravens did end up having a bounce back season going 15 and 2 to barely win the division and get the number one seed and once again jefferson had a pretty solid season with 827 yards for 11 touchdowns but i'm kind of a surprise that with Baltimore he never hit the 1,000 yard mark but it looks like we have a rematch against the Bills in the divisional round and it looks like this time we're gonna get the job done so now we play the Bengals for a trip to the Super Bowl I mean obviously we had a pretty rough end to the season last year so hopefully we can actually get the job done this time I just gotta make sure Justin Tucker doesn't miss any more crucial PAT attempts or field goals we also have JK Dobbins as our number one running back now because we did end up losing Gus Edwards I didn't really realize that until the season already started that's gonna be a first down from Jefferson Jefferson is still a 99 overall but surprisingly enough if you haven't already realized he has lost his x factor I mean he's just like a silver right now which is kind of strange and that's gonna be an interception because Bateman was locked up Lamar's gonna catch him though either way that is a terrible start to the game. We're coming back out here in the third quarter, though. I mean, we have kind of bounced back since then. We're up by three points right now. So if we can score here, obviously, that's going to put us up by 10 points, which would definitely be nice right now. But I mean, that would not be anything near putting the game away just yet because the Bengals do will still have a lot of time on the clock. Come on, Jefferson, get there. That's going to be another first down and some after the juke. I'm going to start abusing the air attacks. It seems like that is working a lot better than the ground game right now. Zay Flowers is going to be wide open as well. So that's going to bring it all the way to the 19. Don't get me wrong. I am very tempted to go for a run of Lamar. If this play doesn't work out, I just might. But I want to try and finish it off with Justin Jefferson here. So hopefully he can be open on this play. 
this is kind of dangerous right now looking at it here but jefferson is going to be wide open and he is barely going to sneak in for the touchdown so i mean that is going to put us up by 10 points the Bengals do still have like a full quarter to work with though so i mean this game is not over just yet but after that thankfully for us it looks like we were able to close the game out the Bengals put up one hell of a fight but either way lamar jackson is headed to his second super bowl and after getting robbed by patrick mahomes twice it looks like this year lamar did finally end up winning mvp and just like last time it looks like we have to play the dallas cowboys in the super bowl i mean they did score on their first drive of the game i feel like we should definitely have the upper hand though because i mean they are eight and nine like this team is below 500 but it seems like they've been kind of going on a miracle run in the playoffs i'm gonna keep it on the ground this time though and try and go for another run of lamar but it looks like parsons is gonna get to us so i mean after that this play looks like it's probably gonna get shut down but i'm gonna run it anyways i'm hoping that jefferson can get open here but it seems like he is locked up so i'm just gonna try and escape with lamar obviously we were not able to get the first down there though so i'm gonna try and go for isaiah likely here we are getting rushed by parsons oh he almost tripped us up but somehow lamar is still gonna get the first down i honestly have no answer for how he escaped there i mean we definitely should have got brought down by micah parsons but i mean lamar is pretty slippery and it looks like we're gonna find jefferson again so that's another first down i mean that play did also put us in scoring position i'm gonna keep it in the air because i mean so far the run game has gotten shut down basically every time so i'm just gonna play it safe here and hopefully we don't end up throwing a pick or anything like that come on mm, we're getting smoked gotta give it to the cowboys man i mean every time we play these guys this defense does not make it easy for us i'm hoping zay Zay's going to be wide open. That's still not going to be a first down, though. But hopefully, we can finish it off with Zay Flowers right here. If not, we might be able to go for J.K. Dobbins. But it looks like he is going to be locked up. Lamar almost got smoked, but Zay is just short again. I honestly thought we had that there. But either way, I'm going for it on fourth down because we only need a couple of inches here. So hopefully, this doesn't backfire. That's a first. And now we also only need the one yard. So hopefully, we can avoid Micah Parsons because if we do i feel like we should be able to sneak in here and it looks like we almost got stopped actually but dobbins is gonna sneak in though so i mean that is gonna put us on the board We're coming back out here in the fourth quarter though we have 38 seconds on the clock to try and get things over with but we are down by three points right now so at the very least we got to get in the field goal position oh we got to keep this on the ground come on lamar he moved we're gonna have a lot of open field so that puts us at least in field goal position i mean i don't want to send it to overtime though to be completely honest with you i'm trying to end this game right here right now so hopefully jefferson that is dangerous but he's gonna catch it so that's gonna put the ravens ahead with 20 seconds on the clock so i mean there is a very high chance that that ends the game right there we still gotta make sure our defense clutches up though because i mean this game is not over yet and thankfully after that it looks like our defense did end up getting the job done so that is gonna be lamar's second super bowl of the day i mean obviously justin jefferson Jefferson was a huge help for this team even though he lost his x factor he is a very big part in both of those super bowl wins but as you can see to end off the video lamar jackson and the baltimore ravens are going to be hoisting another well-deserved lombardi trophy but that's going to do it for this one if you guys enjoyed the video make sure to leave a like and subscribe it really helped out the channel and if you have any video ideas feel free to drop them down in the comment section below i'll try to get to as many of them as i can and while you're down there comment the most random thing you can think of so we can confuse everybody in the comment section but other than that i'll see you guys in the next one peace out